So I'm here in Woods Hole. It's one of the villages here in Falmouth, Massachusetts, in Cape Cod. Thank you very much for the ride, Captain. Darn. Now, this area is known for a lot of things, and for most folks, this is where you catch the ferry to go over to Martha's Vineyard. But there's a more important one, and that is a little funky joint with a self-proclaimed world-famous attitude. That's right, this is Shucker's world-famous Raw Bar and Cafe. I need to get this water out of here. The fish is fresh. Comes from the local waters in Cape Cod. You wouldn't really know it's here unless you walk down that alley. The people that work here, we've known for years. Big stuff, lobster. We love Murph and Karen. They're just wonderful people. Murph's a character, also known as Murphquake, or Chef Kevin Murphy. He and his wife Karen opened this harbor hideaway in 1981 and have been dishing out clams, oysters, and lobsters to locals and tourists ever since. Folks love it here. That's part of their vacation. Every year, they stop on the way or are on their way back from Martha's Vineyard. How many of these are you cooking a day? 50 to 100, depends. And if your main meal isn't a whole lobster, well, it's more than likely there's lobster in there somewhere. I have a big stuff squad. It's the best. The, the fish is flaky yet firm, a very nice sauce. The dish we're gonna make will be our stuffed cod, cod scrod. Remember, the word scrod is really not a species of fish. It's no. It's the size of the fish. So you're saying when it's smaller, it's a scrod? It's a scrod. So let's take these in and then we'll, then we'll pick the meat, right? Sounds good, you okay. got that right. We're gonna just rip off the tail, just crack it with your hand. A lot of people cut the shell with their... When you're doing as much lobster as we are, we can't... We don't have time, so We haven't got time to do that kind of stuff. We're gonna chop it up a little bit. Cracker crumbs. Okay. Use some pepper, paprika, and melted butter. All right, so we've got that mixed. I'm gonna cut a piece of fish for you. Okay. We buy native cod. There is nothing fresher than the fish we buy today because it swam in the bay yesterday. Don't you say? What we're gonna do is we're gonna take a little bit of the thicker end, and I'm gonna take that nice lobster stuffing we just made and put it on top of the cod. How long? OK, so that's going to go 12 to 15 minutes. Now we're making? We're going to make a beurre blanc sauce here. Okay. Put some butter in the pan. Is we're going to put the shallots in there, Sauvignon Blanc wine. And what's this? That's a little simple syrup. Ooh. Adds some sweetness to it. Takes okay. the bite out of the shallots. Got it. Then the next thing I have here is a mixture of butter and cream. We're going to let that reduce down. It's going to take maybe 15 to 20 minutes at medium heat. We have the, the garnishes Scallop on the Scallop potatoes. Oh, a gratin, not scallop. Oh, gratin, Come buddy. Oh, gratin. Look at this beauty here, huh? We're going to take that beurre blanc sauce, and we want to ladle a good bit right over the fish. We're going to garnish it. A little dill weed, a little lemon. We're ready. This is the real Cape Cod thing. It tastes bright and fresh, and I like to see. Nice and flaky and light. Great seafood flavor. The Beurre Blanc is dynamite. Nice amount of wine in that. Chef, nice job. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. I'm telling you. I like it. Murph Quake! Hello, we have the Big Stuff Scrod. Delicious. The fish is tender and sweet. I taste a little lemon. Perfecto. The right amount of lobster, fresh fish, incredible sauce. Hello, I have your lobster boil for you. The quality and quantity of the food is first class. But it's not just the bomb food bringing customers back. You want the seafood in the right environment. You're right on the water. Actually, we're floating as we speak. This is what you look for when you come to a Cape Cod place. So even though you are right in the heart of the tourist area, you're doing it legit Keep paying respects to how the seafood should be treated. That's the whole deal. You're exactly right. The seafood is the star of the show. You got that straight. Excellent Thank job. Thank you so much. Appreciate the man, it. the myth, huh? the character.